looking at my arms, I look like I've become a cutter, but instead I was joined on Friday by Celia Davis and Patty Putnam and Dulcie Taylor uh, and Ray Merritt uh, to, and Scott Reuter uh, to try to make a bamboo screen to cover our despicable hole. And it was a beautiful screen, but it just about killed me to top down the 50 uh, canes that it, it took to do a five foot section, which you could then still see through. It hit the fence beautifully, but it didn't do a darn thing to hide the hole. So, um, uh, Dulcie Taylor would like to continue, and she encourages you all to go out and, and, and crawl through bamboo jungles and uh, try to get the hole. But thank you very much, Mr. Estes and Mr. Harrington, who both came out and who sort of jumped on my bandwagon about this and, and provided um, guidance and Google's right away and it was a great effort but I we won't be going forward and it may be I think given a little more time to see where we are that Mr. Harrington's proposal of uh, one of the tennis court screens of some color if we are going to be living with this for a while would be useful because um, there was it was a great opportunity to talk to visitors and residents and business owners and really see how you know, maybe because we spend a lot of time downtown, we don't notice it as much, but everybody else does. And um, so thank you for that. And I think I'll just stop there. Thanks for having